What's up guys? Welcome back to the shop. I'm Greg from Masterson's Car Care and today I'm going to show you how to wash a car from start to finish with one product using our Masterson's Waterless Wash and Shine. Now our friend Becky just picked up this Nissan Versa. Now it's a used Versa but it's new to her. She just upgraded her car and this is a big upgrade from her last car. Now we're going to show you how to wash the car from start to finish using our Masterson's Waterless Wash and Shine because this Nissan Versa has not been washed in over two months since Becky picked it up. Now Becky lives in an apartment, so if you're like Becky and you live in an apartment or a condo and you don't have access to water, this is gonna be a great tutorial to show you how to wash a car start to finish. Let me show you guys what we're gonna use today. We're gonna use one of my favorite products and this is our Masterson's Waterless Wash and Shine. Now it comes in a full-size gallon if you're a professional detailer or you wanna detail a lot of cars. It also comes in a 16 ounce bottle that it gives you easy access to detailing anywhere, anytime. Now I love this product because this is a full waterless wash system. So it completely replaces a bucket and water wash system and you can detail a whole car, every part of the vehicle, the paint, the glass, the plastic, the wheels, the rims, everything using this one product. So this is gonna be a great solution for Becky who lives in an apartment. Now she wanted one product to detail the whole car because she's a very simple person and wants a simple detailing process to detail her vehicle. So I told this is going to be a great way to detail it. We're going to do it, do it with the Masterson's Waterless Wash and Shine, and we're just going to use some basic green microfiber towels. So this is the complete kit that we're going to hook Becky up right with after this video so she has everything to complete her detailing right when she gets in home. Now, one thing I like to do with my Masterson's Waterless Wash and Shine is I like to upgrade my sprayer. So I put on a Tolco Professional Sprayer. It's fully adjustable, and it gives you more spray and a better spray stream of product with one pull. So you guys can pick up these online right on our website and it gives you great detailing capabilities when you upgrade to a sprayer. So let's just get detailing right off the bat. I'm going to take two microfiber towels to start with and I'm going to take our product. Now the product comes in a gallon size so if you actually want to detail a lot of cars you can actually take the product, dilute it, and you can actually dilute it up to five to one. We're going to use it right out of the bottle so it has great cleaning capabilities. Now uh, I like to take my microfiber towels and rip off my tags. It's the first thing I always like to do. If you have brand new microfiber towels, always uh, rip off the tags. If you guys come in close and see, this car is really dirty. It has a lot of industrial filth on the top of the car, on the whole outside of the car. The glass is dirty. The rims are dirty. It's a completely dirty car. So let's show you guys how to wash the car using zero water. Now I like to take my microfiber towels first. I like to fold them in fours. So take your microfiber towel, fold it one way long and then one way short. And then coming close, let's show you guys how to do the waterless wash. So first, take your waterless wash and shake it up. And then we're going to go ahead and spray the surface. Now I'm going to go ahead and cover about half the hood with the product. And I just spray enough on the car to cover the surface. Now already right now, the waterless wash is working and encapsulating the dirt. If you guys come in close and look, it's sticking to the dirt and it's pulling off the contaminants off the surface. So I'm going to take my microfiber towel and I'm just going to pull in one direction. Wow, look at that. Easily in one direction, it pulls off all the dirt, all the grime. And that's why I told Becky, I'm like, man, this is a great solution to wash your car at home. Now, after you go ahead and clean the surface, on there is our synthetic sealant that's actually inside of the waterless wash and shine. That's gonna seal up the car and protect it for up to 14 days. So let's go ahead and just buff off that sealant and get a good shine. There we go. This is great. And look at the difference that it made over your filthy, dirty, clean hood. So fast, so easy. So I'm actually going to detail this whole car. And I want you guys to join me on detailing this whole car start to finish, just like I did right now with the waterless. I'll show you guys how I do it. Let's take our uh, waterless wash and shine, just spray it on the surface. I like to give enough just to cover the hood. You can tell this car sits outside. There's a leaf right here. So let's throw it on. I put my waterless wash down and let's just take my microfiber towel and let's go in a snake pattern. You see a snake pattern? This pulls off the dirt and I'm actually rolling my wrist while I do that. Check that out. I rolled my wrist and that's all the dirt that was on that hood. I'm going to sit down my microfiber, go back to my secondary and let's just go ahead and buff. So easy, so fast. I really love waterless washing because you can actually wash the car anywhere, anytime. It's so great and I love that we're doing it on a white car. White's actually the most popular color for any car. So if you guys are out there and you got a white car, comment below. We'd love to know how you wash your white car and keep it looking great. Let's move on to the front. I'm going to refold my microfiber towel. 
And let's just start on the bumper and the headlights. There we go. We're in the shade right now, so I can actually spray the whole front of the car with the waterless wash. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna take my microfiber towel. One wipe took off all that dirt and grime. We're gonna go back to the grill a little later. This grill is a hard grill to clean. There's a lot of different uh, holes and vents. We're gonna come back with some dressing a little bit later and a little bit of air and blow out the grill. This towel is already getting dirty, guys. A little dirt that's coming off. Oof, that's a dirty one, okay? Let's flip a towel right over this cleaner side and let's start cleaning. So easy with the waterless wash and shine. It makes detailing fast and easy. I actually have a motorcycle. I actually have a few motorcycles and I really like washing the uh, motorcycles using the waterless wash. It actually is very easy to wash the whole vehicle and get it ready for the road or even get it ready for my garage. This towel is almost done. Check it out, boom, but look at the, the four towel fold. Gives me a few more sides, so I got two more sides over here I can keep using. Here we go. I'm, I'm glad you guys are able to watch me today while I do this because uh, this is actually how I would just watch any vehicle. And I'm kind of able to do this in real time for you over this whole car. So if you guys like our channel, remember give this uh, video a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Check out all the other videos we have right here on our channel. And there we go, bumper's already done. So easy to do. Okay guys, let's move over to the side. This side, filthy dirty. We're all gonna do the wheels last because these wheels, they're really dirty. But let's just go ahead and start anywhere on the vehicle. Now, normally when you're washing a car, you have to go from the top to the bottom. But the cool thing about Masterson's Waterless Wash and Shine is it, it concentrates the cleaning power to wherever I wanna spray it. So I'm actually gonna spray it over the whole car. And check out on this window, how when you spray the waterless wash, it doesn't drip off, it just sticks to the surface. And once it grabs onto dirt, it starts to pull it off. So right there, those, those are some dirt areas. Once it grabs onto the dirt, it starts to pull off the dirt. Let's just go ahead and just cover the surface, man. And this one's dirty, guys. Look over here how dirty it is down here by the lower portion. But when we spray it on, it's already starting to pull off the dirt. So let's go ahead and take our microfiber towel and let's just start cleaning. Snake pattern, I'm about ready to switch out my towel, but wow, you already see on the glass how great it pulled off the dirt. Just so easy, so fast. I'm gonna flip the towel over. This is my last use of this towel, but oh wow. <laughs> this is really cool guys, look at that difference. <laughs> wow, look at all the contamination that's off that. That's just really gross. Even right here in the door cup, Spray in there. Let's take our microfiber and let's just clean the door cup. There we go. This is actually my last wipe of the towel. I'll show you why. Look, this towel is completely dirty. Look, completely dirty. It's actually one more spot right here that I could use, so let's utilize it. Okay, guys, let's go all the way down. And if you guys notice, I'm wiping in one direction. And look, it's taken off that heavy contamination and that dirt. Wow, it's gross, okay. We're gonna work all the way to the bottom. There we go. Cool, okay. Now this towel is spent. I'm gonna go put it on my cart. And I'm gonna grab my, my uh, buffing towel. This buffing towel will now become my new washing towel. And then I'll go grab a new washing towel, or a new buffing towel to buff off. What I'm doing right now, guys, is I'm actually buffing off any synthetic sealant that's on the vehicle. Inside of the Masterson's Waterless Wash and Shine, there's actually synthetic sealant in the product and that's actually designed to protect the vehicle till your next wash. So we do a lot of research and development here at Masterson's Car Care and through a lot of R&D that we did and um, survey, we found out that people actually wash their car seven to 10 days after their last wash on average. So what we like to do is um, we created this product to actually protect the vehicle for the time frame that our customers are detailing their car. So this will actually go 14 days, two weeks. 
uh, to make the car protected. So it's a great alternative to getting the car looking good. Now remember, this is a waterless wash system. It replaces bucket and water washing, but you still wanna do great detailing on your vehicle, um, like clay bar or waxing, ceramic coating, conditioning of your vehicle. You still wanna do that, um, those processes when you wash the vehicle. This car is actually in need of a full detail clay bar service as well that I really recommend. Let's clean the mirror, guys. Check out how dirty this mirror is. I like the waterless wash and shine because how much I'm able to concentrate. Like, look, I was able to concentrate it without getting any other area of the car wet or dirty. Wow, there we go. Cool, nice. So fast, so easy. Okay guys, let's go back to the glass. See the sealant right here? This is the synthetic sealant that's in the waterless wash. You guys can see it a little bit more on the glass. And look how I'm able to buff it off of the glass. That's great. So fast, so easy. There we go, flip it over. Wow, and that's why our Masterson's waterless wash and shine is a true like one detailed product. You literally can just use this one product and detail your whole entire car. That's, that's great, man, like totally great. I'm gonna have to go back and just get some little final touches in the corners and roll down the window a little bit, but just from like a basic wipe, that's a million times better uh, on these two windows. Hope you guys can see that on the camera, guys. And then after you guys check that out, just come back over here. We're just gonna clean this bottom of the door. Now what I'm doing is I'm just buffing off the sealant. I'm getting that shine, man. Now this is a used car. It's not a brand new car, but it's new to our friend Becky. So we just wanna make sure that the car is clean, great for her. And check out this trim right here. This trim looks dry. It looks faded. It looks like it's sun damaged. Let's see what the waterless wash does to the trim. Wow, look at that. Big difference, huh guys? Let me go ahead and buff this off. It's great because our waterless wash, it conditions. So look at that. That's just a really big difference. It already looks better. We didn't even use any type of dressing or uh, trim restore on it. We just used our waterless wash and shine. So let's keep going on this. Put this towel up here. Okay, let's spray the door. I can actually spray the whole side of this car. This car is so small, really easy to wash, easy to park in if you have an apartment. Okay. So I'm gonna take my uh, towel, I'm gonna open it to a clean side, and then let's just start cleaning from the top to the bottom. And it even takes off these hard stains on the glass. Any embedded contaminants is gonna take it off. There we go. And wipe in one direction. There we go, so easy. Look at all the dirt that's now on the towel. I'm gonna also come in here with the door cup and clean with the door cup. Take our microfiber towel and just give it a good buff. And what we're doing is we're buffing off the sealant. The sealant is where you get the shine, the luster, the gloss. This is a white car. It's um, white cars, once they're clean, they always look clean. But this sealant that's inside of the product if you have a dark colored car, like a dark, uh, like a black, dark green, red, dark blue, uh, these colors, they look very glossy with this Masterson's waterless wash and shine. And what our customers tell us that use both products is they say, hey, our, um, uh, my car looks better after the waterless wash than it did by using with water. And that's because when people wash the car with water, water does not have any cleaning capabilities. The soap has cleaning capabilities. And if the soap had any, um, if the soap doesn't have any like gloss enhancers in the, in the solution, you're not going to get any more gloss from the paint. You're just removing the dirt off the paint and now the paint's looking clean. But with the Masterson's waterless wash and shine, you're washing and you're shining in one step. You're clean, shine, and protect your vehicle all in one step. So you're actually doing three steps in one. Okay, here we go. Let's 
take this, give it a good wash, boom. So easy to buff. I can already tell this car would totally be a great candidate for clay. Feels a little rough, it needs some clay. So maybe after this, I'm gonna talk to Becky and I'm gonna show her our clay bar kit and hopefully she picks one up or maybe she'll have us do the service for her. Okay. Okay, move it on the back. Move it on the back, okay, cool. Okay, now this is the, totally the dirtiest part, guys. Check this out, this is the back of the car. Filthy, dirty area. On hatchbacks, the back of the car, it just gets really dirty from the wind turbulence. So let's really put the waterless wash, guys, to the test and show you guys how great it works on the back of this car. So let's take our waterless wash, shake it up. I always like to shake it up before I start using it keeps it activated, and let's just cover the whole vehicle. It's a little windy out here today, but it's great so you guys can see exactly what it looks like real world conditions. Just so you guys know, um, it's about 90 degrees out here right now. We're in Southern California. We're in the shade, but right outside in the sun, it's really hot. You can even use this product in the sun if you like, which is super cool, um, but we recommend to do it in the shade. You're gonna get better results. This car's really dirty. I haven't been washing in like 60 days, man. Whew. Okay. But you see how it just grabs to the, the, the um, it grabs to the surface. And you guys notice, look, no drip. That's the best part about this. You can wash the car anywhere with no drip. So if you live somewhere like Los Angeles, San Francisco, San Diego, somewhere where you want to be more environmentally conscious about your runoff going into uh, the lakes or oceans, what a lot of people don't understand about car washing is when you wash your car with water, any of that runoff is actually going into the ocean and it's going into the lakes, it's going into your water streams. So if you are an eco-conscious person, right here we believe Mother Nature uh, is our number one priority. We uh, really want to make products that reduce runoff, reduce chemicals into our ocean and preserves our wildlife and our nature. And this is the best way to do that. Easy on, easy off. Don't want to drop that. Easy on, easy off. And uh, it's a great product to get this done. Let's go ahead and just show you on the glass. This glass was dirty, right? And we're not going to use a glass cleaner on this job. We're only going to use one product. Uh, a great detail or a great add-on would be to purchase our Masterson's glass cleaner. You don't have to purchase it with this product but it's gonna make your glass have even more clarity and even more um, uh, shine uh, when you use glass cleaner. Uh, the waterless wash and shine works great, but if you really want that true shine, man, just grab the glass cleaner. Okay, I'm gonna come back and get those uh, little last streaks off a little bit later. Put my microfiber down and let's grab my wash one. My wash one is getting pretty dirty, guys, okay? But we still got a lot of sides. Keep flipping the towel. Oh, there we go. Look at that, so dirty. So dirty, guys. If you guys have like a, uh, a, um, an area like this where there's a lot of grime in the, um, in the emblem, you can go ahead and take your uh, product and you can actually flush it in there. There we go. And look how it just took out all of the grime from the emblem. There we go. Took a lot of it out. This car is totally gonna re be required a clay bar service. And you can see because there's a lot of industrial contaminants in the emblems and around the license plate that we want to take care of. Let's flip the towel over. Look how we have a dirty side. That's how we know our towel's dirty. But look at this clean side right over there. Just go ahead and slip to the clean side. Okay. And let's keep cleaning, man. This is about how fast I would clean normally if I do my own cars. I love using waterless on my own cars, my own motorcycles too. And don't be worried about uh, the level of dirt. Like if you have a really dirty car, um, this is gonna work great. This is a great example because this is actually worse than like mud. All of this black that you see right here is actually industrial contaminants. And what that is, is that's things like metals, fuels, a lot of just horrible stuff in the air. It lands on the car. Dirt's natural, dirt's in nature. Dirt's not gonna harm your car, but you know what will? All these industrial contaminants and pollutants, they will take years off your vehicle. Um, and you wanna make sure that you get that off the car as soon as possible, okay? There we go. 
so easy to wash this car using no water, man. And this is going to be great because uh, Becky wanted to see how, how you wash a car with, without water. She was like, I keep taking my car to the car wash, but she has a parking structure. Why not hang out in the parking structure, wash the whole car, right? Dude, big difference. Big difference right here. Let's move on to the, uh, the bumper. We're actually using a lot of product on this, if you guys notice. Uh, and that's because this car is like considerably dirty, really dirty. Okay. There we go. It's going to clean all the way down. Oh, all the way to the top, from the top to the bottom. Boom. So dirty, okay? There we go. Cool. Okay, this rag is spent. I want to show you guys what a spent rag looks like. Totally spent rag. I'm going to go ahead and just grab my other rag. I like to make my buff rag my new wash rag. It's still got a lot. And I'm going to go back right now and get another buff rag. You could actually do this process with one towel if you wanted to. Coming close, guys. Check it out. There we go. Okay. Come over here to this corner, man. Look at this. This is so dirty. Oh, wow. The difference. Sorry, guys. We got this uh, big truck here. This is like the most realist detailing. I love this channel. If you guys like this channel, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to click that subscribe button, man. Uh, it really does keep our channel growing, and we love showing you new detailing tips and tricks. Let me just go ahead and grab another towel really quick. Here we go. Like I've been telling you guys, always uh, pull off your tag. I, I usually, when I detail a car waterless, I like to use about 12 towels, somewhere in between the, the, the range of 6 to 12. This is going to be a really dirty car, so I'd probably use close to 12. Here we go. Big difference, guys, already, man. Like, this, the back of the car was so dirty, and this looks really great. So let's move on to the wheels. I'm going to show you how to do the wheels, and then if you guys notice, I'm really short. I need to get a ladder uh, to clean the top right here. So I'm going to show you guys how to clean the wheels, and then I'm going to flip the car around so I can clean that other side. Let's go to the wheels. Okay, we're back in the game. So now we're going to show you guys how to clean the wheels. I'm not even going to use tire dressing. I'm just going to use our Masterson's Waterless Wash and Shine. I'm just going to mist it on. And I don't need to worry about getting it on the brake caliper or the um, a brake rotor. Uh, right when the car drives away, it's going to come off. This is a water-based cleaner, so it's totally just going to just come off, and it's not going to affect the brakes whatsoever. I'm also going to spray the uh, tire as well. Great, huh? So let's take our microfiber towel, and let's just clean. And look how easy it cleans. These are really small wheels on this little Versa. It makes it very easy to clean. But we're taking off that brake dust so easy. Yeah, if you have a little car like this, why spend your time getting a bucket and water out? I would just use the waterless, save time, save money, uh, and you also save water because you're not wasting so much water. And you know what the cool part about waterless washing is, is that you don't um, have to do it outside. You can do it in your garage. We wanted to do it outside to show you guys you know, what it's like doing it outside, but you can wash your whole car inside your garage, which is like the best part. Go inside a little bit later, spend some time on the details right here. And I'm going to take my microfiber and I'm just going to clean the tire. And look how it actually conditions the rubber. That's great, huh? It actually looks like there's like a low gloss or a medium gloss tire shine on there. That's so cool. There we go. Look at that. That's great. And it's dry to the touch, man. That's really cool. So just by spraying the waterless wash on here and just giving a good wipe, I was able to just completely clean off the wheel. I'm actually going to go in here with the waterless, give a good wipe. And look at the wheel. It's already looking a million times better. And then you notice there's a little bit of waterless wash on the brake rotor. Don't worry. Right when the car drives away, it's going to just um, uh, disappear and evaporate right off of the brake rotor because the Masters is waterless, is waterless wash. So I'm going to go ahead and clean the front glass. I'm going to clean the roof of the car. I'm going to turn the car around and clean that too. And then we're going to show you guys the final results. We'll see you guys soon. 
So there we go, guys. Now we finished washing our Nissan Versa. Now we did this whole detail using zero water and only one product using our Masterson's waterless wash and shine. And this car is completely clean and it has that beautiful shine. Now Becky is gonna be able to wash her car at her apartment using zero water. So if you want a new way to wash your car, you wanna save time by not setting up those buckets, those hoses, those pressure washers, and you wanna save money using one product, pick up our Masterson's waterless wash and shine you can pick it up online, link in the bio, and get the best detailing supplies for your ride. Because with our Masters' Waterless Wash and Shine, you save money, you save time, and it makes your car just simply look amazing right after every wash. Now, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to click that subscribe button. Check out all the other videos we have right here on our channel. Now, I'm Greg from Masterson's Car Care. We'll see you next time. Always remember, have fun, stay clean, and keep on detailing.